hello friends so in this video tutorial of Excel we will learn how to create or how to get the compound interest of an uh, principal amount which is yearly so if the case is yearly first of all we have taken the case of yearly so how much interest we will get if our rate of interest is 7% our principal amount is 1 lakh and time duration is 2 years so after the end of each year interest is given so what we need to do we divide we have to make a chart here where we have taken first year and second year because after each year the interest will be given so here what we will do we will write down 1 lakh 1 2 and then we will go to the interest and find out what will be the interest to finding the interest we will uh, press equal to sign here and then we will select this principal amount and just multiply it with 7% so we will get our first year interest and what will be the new principal interest new principal with interest will be equal to we just add our principal amount with the interest which we have got in the first year so which it will be 1 lakh 7000 now what we need to do we need to take this to the second year also so what we need to do we need to lock this C4 cell we need to uh, lock this C4 cell like when we will drag it out to the second year so it remain to be the same so we will just press on C4 and press F4 from our keyboard and then let's press enter now what we need to do now we go to the second year and put an equal to sign here and we need to copy this here so after putting an equal to here the formula will be added here so we got the amount which we have got in the beginning of our first year now for the second year what we need to we just need to drag it out till the end and similarly we drag, drag this also so in this way we can find out the interest annually using a compound interest formula similarly if we are looking for a half yearly interest so we have made a chart here we have taken the same amount 1 lakh here 7 interest is the interest 2 years is the time duration now if the 2 years is the time duration and if we are giving compound interest half yearly so we divide the year into 2 parts 1 and 2 similarly second year also into 2 parts so we have a 4 we have to find interest in 4 parts in 4 times in a year so first of all we will write down a principal here then we will go to the interest put an equal to here then we will select this then multiply it with 7% and this is for half year so what we need to do we press multiply sign here from the keyboard and then put 6 divided by 12 and then press enter so we will get the interest of our first quarter now what we need to do here we need to put an F4 here to lock this to lock this interest rate it re remain to be the same then we go to here put equal to just add both of them interest and principal so we will get the new principal amount with interest now we will go to this cell put equal to just copy this formula then go to the interest and what we need to do we need just drag it and similarly we drag this also so we will get the interest half yearly so this is the way we can find out the interest half yearly suppose we have to find out the interest quarterly so same thing is apply like in a quarter there are four months so it's of two years time so it's so so we have to give interest eight time we have to compound it eight times so here we have to take on the principal amount five year then we will go to interest put equal to then we will take this principal amount multiply it with the interest rate rate of interest which is seven percent and this time we will give it giving it quarterly so we multiply it with 3 and divide it by 12 so we will get the interest our quarterly and similarly here we need to lock this C4 cell because we want this interest to be remain the same each and every year every every quarter so we will press F4 here and enter similarly we go here put equal to select this cell and add it with the interest and enter now we go to the second second quarter put equal to sign and take this new interest 
new principal interest and press enter now what we need to do we just need to drag it and we just need to drag it now I just drag this out throughout the columns <coughs> and then I just drag, drag this also and then drag this also so we will finally got the figures in our sheets so this is the way we can find out the yearly interest half yearly interest and quarterly interest after applying a formula so that's all from this side so if you like it you can subscribe us or even follow us on facebook